Good day. For today's video, we are going to discuss Arts 10, Quarter 3 Module 1, Philippine Media-Based Arts, Print Media. Introduction. Many people believe that print media is dying due to the easy access of information in modern technology. But still there are people who are fun of reading printed materials, such as newspapers, tabloids, comics and magazines. In Philippine print media art, there is a person who used to be famous with his creativity and rich imagination in making great stories in comics. He is Antonio, Tony Velasquez, dubbed as the father of Philippine comics. One of his first comics is the Kenkoi. Comics. In the contemporary print media, newspapers, tabloids, comics, and magazines still exposes the events and scenarios in politics, society, environment, and even in the entertainment, our showbiz business. One of the great innovations in the field of print media is the comics. Comics can be seen already in the print and digital platforms. Comic writers, illustrators, and cartoonists use modern media and techniques like the use of computer, specialized stylus pen, and digital pads to create visuals and illustrations. Contemporary Comics Artists Antonio Velasquez Velasquez is known as the father of Tagalog comics and founding father of Philippine comic industry. Some of his notable works are the creation of Kenkoi that was published in the Tagalog language Liwayway magazine and designed product labels for Philippine products advertisements. Mars Ravello. He is known as the king of comics. Ravello's works had been adopted to films and captivated Filipinos for generations like Darna, Dizabel, Captain Barbell, and Lastikman. Mr. Larry Alcala. Loro, Larry, Zarate Alcala, is a well-known editorial cartoonist and illustrator in the Philippines. He was a national artist for visual arts for his Kalabog and Basio and Mang Ambo. Mr. Paul Medina Jr. Apollonio, Paul. Medina Jr. is a Filipino cartoonist best known for his comic strip Pugod Baboy and Kako Machine Comics. He worked for The Inquirer, Rappler, and The Philippine Star. Manix Abrera. Manuel, Manix Abrera, is the author of the daily comic strip, Kako Machine Comics in the Philippine Daily Inquirer, and the weekly webcomic News Hardcore, in GMA News Online. He has currently authored 20 books, and has won the National Book Awards, for his wordless graphic novel, 14, Comics Compilation, News Hardcore, and Comics Compilation Kako Machine Comics 14. Alaala Nong Kinabukasan. Characteristics of Philippine print media. Number 1. It displays nationalistic fervor, deep rooted in the spirit of succeeding Filipino journalists throughout our nation's history, up to present. Number 2. It expresses libertarian and free enterprise principles, newspapers, tabloids, magazines and other printed materials have the freedom to express the writer's thoughts, ideas, and principles. Aside from being commercial in nature, the press is dependent on advertising as its lifeblood. Number 3. It is informative and entertaining in nature. There are printed materials that are used to give information in terms of lifestyle, health, and fashion, and as for the entertainment, there are comics, pocketbooks, and other similar materials, among others. Number 4. It reflects Philippine tradition and culture. It shows the lives of people their tradition and culture. In the contemporary print media, such as comics, it used to present the pop culture in terms of political, societal, and environmental issues. Pugod Baboy showcases domestic life, adventure, drama, and pure spoof sequences. More often, the strip mirrors the general sentiment of the Filipino people on relevant topics, such as corruption in the government, as well as Filipino pop culture. I hope you learned something in our lesson for today. See you again in our next video. Thank you for listening.